got him! We've got the Dragonborn! Dragonborn? What the... Who, what? So, it really is the Dragonborn. Just can't stop being a thorn in our side, huh? He has to stick a truth. How does this guy know you, King Douchebag? King Douchebag? Is that what you told him your name was? Why didn't you tell them your real name, Dovahkiin? You what? don't remember, do you? How we tried to find you? Look, that stick belongs with the Fighters of Zaron. Give it back. Fighters of Zaron? Boys, what's going on here is much more complex than that. This isn't the first time a UFO has crashed to Earth. You see, in 1947, a UFO crashed in Roswell, New Mexico. Oh, God. Oh, brother, spare us. Hang on a sec. A UFO crashed in Roswell, and a new government agency was created to investigate the paranormal. Our agency. Can we skip this? Like, hit the skip button or something? Oh, you don't want to skip this. Yes, we do. Whenever aliens are spotted, vampires run amok, our agency is there, and we have never lost a fight. That is, until four years ago when we investigated a child. Yawn, yawn, yawn. A child who had an unnatural power inside him. I had orders from the president to secure the child so that we could harness his powers before our enemies could. But he slipped through our hands. The government wants the new kid for his farts? That's dumb. His farts? No. His amazing ability to make friends so quickly on any social network. Before he was five years old, he had 3.2 billion friends on Facebook alone. Do you have any idea the power that kind of gift yields in today's world? It's time to come with us, Dovahkiin. Time to stop resisting and use your gift for your country. Is he really still talking? Are we so different, you and I, Dovahkiin? Uh. You have to do what the government tells you to do, just like me. <laughs> We're all just pawns in their game. I'll admit you are fascinating. You have more power than any child I've ever come across, and yet all you seem to really care about is this. It must be very important. What does it do? Whoever controls the stick controls the universe, dumbass. Yeah, stupid. Controls the... But then... I wouldn't have to do what I was told anymore. I could... <laughs> I control the universe! Get back! Back, I say, all of you! I can do anything, anything I want! <laughs> I no longer need you, new kid! I control oh the universe! Oh my god. Ah! Aha! Ah! Ah! Damn thing! How does it work? Show me how it works! Yeah, right. Dovahkiin, why should we be on the opposite sides? Join me, Dovahkiin. Rule by my side. Rule. And you can have this all to yourself forever. I can offer you all! Just get me safely out of here! You can rule with this once again! You underestimated the character of the fighters of Zaron. What binds us is more than that relic. And you failed to recognize the character of our alliance. Yes, and that friendship is more important to any of us than even the stick of truth. Dude, where are you going? <laughs> Princess Kenny! No At least way, one Kenny. of you has some sense. You'd sell us all out? But why, Princess Kenny? Because Princess Kinney was born a half-orc, whose entire village was wiped out by humans and elves. Morgan Freeman? You see, when humans and elves lived together in the forest of Hollow Falls, an elven queen fell in love with the orc known as Dandar, the first one to possess the Stick of Truth. They loved in secret and had a child. A beautiful little girl, a girl who watched as everyone she loved was killed in cold blood. And that is why she waited and plotted, all this time, to take the stick from you. For Princess Kinney is true heir to the Stick of Truth. Wow, that's pretty cute. Just one thing, Morgan Freeman. How come every time something convoluted needs explaining, you show up? Because every time I show up and explain something, I earn a freckle. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Princess Kinney, come back here! Oh my god. The battle continues. We must stop Princess Queenie. Let's go. Uh, 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 yeah, up here. Ye old shot. Welcome, weary adventurer. Can I interest you in some of my wares? 
I like to buy things, yes. I'm sorry, I sneeze, guys, if you guys, if you guys heard that. Ooh, wait a minute. Adds five bleeding on perfect attacks? That's crazy. Changes with 250 HP from bleeding targets. Ooh, that's a crazy combo right there. Wait a minute. Sorry, that's just a crazy combo for me not to buy that. Clyde's wig, might as well. I don't think I really need anything else. Now. Ooh, we got new armor. Let's go. Oh, that's sick. Now, as far as our weapon goes, did I get a new weapon? Did not. But I do think I want to get... I want to modify this. Oh, I didn't even modify it to begin with. Oh, I didn't have a, anything on the blade? What the heck? Wait, what is this? Um, Hot Topic Cattle. Yeah, yeah. Put that. Ah, Ninja Stars, let's go. Modify those with... um. Fire damage is just too good for me not to accept it, man. I'm so sorry. All right, let's go. Give us a stick, Princess Kenny. You don't want to go down like this, Beth. Oh, no, he didn't. Fresh meat for my trusty wolf companion. No way, dude. Dick has been out for so long, dude. What's she doing? No, Kenny, don't drink that! Ah, Nazi zombie princess Kenny! Fuck! <laughs> this is it, King Douchebag! The final battle! Your buddies stand with you! I would just stand over here. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Kenny! That's a lot of damage. Good thing I got these ninja stars. Go get him, boy! Let's go. Hit them with the zombie vomit! Yeah. 
Take all the dying is making her tired. Keep killing her. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Kitty. Oh, God. Sorry. I was not paying attention there. That was my fault. Okay, wait. Wait a second. Oh, my God. Dude. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's get myself back up. The power of taco compels me. All right, buddy. Hammer of truth. Hit them with the zombie vomit! Good blocks. Oh wait, wait, wait. Health potion first. What am I doing, dude? Maybe I should have bought some more small health potions. The princess is magic! It's so pretty! Actually, I actually shouldn't have done that. I forgot my freaking ninja star is healing. I could have got 1200 health just by doing that. Uh, unfortunately. And Butters also heals too. I forgot about this. It's okay. You can heal Butters up a little bit. That should be good. Let's try an ability here. Let's go. Professor Chaos time. Let's see how you like dealing with me. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Kitty! You're straight tripping, sir. Uh, Alright, maybe put a bleed on this time? Maybe? Come on, new kid, finish her off! Fight for a game and hide! Go for the check it. That comes for you, Dragonborn. You'd better pray for a miracle. Oh, hamburgers! So much for that. <laughs> Foolish Princess Kitty. Do you not know that death is a servant of chaos? How can this be? Well, that chaos energy is making me a little woozy. Power of friendship. Fight for a demon hide for all the souls. A fight of fire. Fight for a demon hide. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Kitty. For all the souls. Hit them with the zombie vomit! He's alive again. She doesn't stay dead! We can't beat her! Two were fucked! There's no way! There is one way! We're gonna have to break the gentleman's code! What? Carmen, you can't possibly mean- What other choice do we have, Cal? King Douchebag! You remember long ago! I made you swear an oath to never fart on anyone's boss. I am now asking you no. to break that oath. He's right, it's our only chance. Fart on Princess Kitty's boss, King Douchebag! Do it! Sorry guys, break all but we're back. Now King Douchebag, fart on Princess Kitty's boss! What about the gentleman's oath? I've got to... I've got to do it. I have to do that. I have no other choice. Princess Kitty can't win. You've got to stop her. I've got to do it, guys. I have to. Don't be blinded by her b b b b tits. I have to fart. I have to fart on That princess is a stone cold bitch. Fight for a demon hide! What? We're back to normal. We're, we're cured. We're all better now, Daddy. That's right, son. The dragonborn must have farted on a princess's balls.
We did what we had to do, guys. It wasn't the most noble of victories, but sometimes you must fart on a princess's balls in order to win. You guys sure about this? There's no other way. It drove our friend to madness and nearly killed us all. So what do you guys want to play now? How about dinosaur hunters? Or pharaohs and mummies? Let's ask Douchebag. What do you want to play next, dude? Uh, let's click to speak. Screw you guys. I'm going home. Wow, what a dick. Oh, what the heck? Well, Alright, guys. I assume that was the end of South Park with Dick of Truth. At least I think it was. There's so much more that I have to do in this game. I still have to find all the homeless people. I still have to find, I think, one missing kid. There's a couple of things I have to do, too, that I have not done yet. So this won't be the end, end of our gameplay, but this will be probably the end of uh, the story in which we're playing. We have a couple probably bonus episodes coming out pretty soon. Just me 100% in the game because, you know, I like the 100% things and get all the achievements if I can. But uh, until then, man, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I really do hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you next time for even more South Park The Stick of Truth. It's your boy, Toby. Goodbye. Oh, 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 wait. Please like and subscribe. All right, now bye.